she's over. Oh, that's good. So welcome to the 15th annual Jury Peace Conference. And yeah, we made it this far. My name is John Amidon, for a few of you who might not know me. And Marina Munn, who is our co-facilitator, uh, is walking up right now. So I was wondering how many people out there are under 40 years old. <laughs> somewhere along, uh, along the way, and I just want to say that this event has already been awesome because of all of you, your presence, your energy, your commitment, your passion, it's contagious. Just being near you is, is thrilling and uh, awesome. So thank you for being here, and thank you for the energy that one can only hope comes to a tipping point as we continue. As John said, some of us for many decades and others of us inspired to follow along um, on this incredible quest. So have a wonderful day. It's already great as far as I'm concerned. I'm going to introduce Ray McGovern. Most many of you know him already. And uh, we do things quite informally here. Uh, but anyway, Ray, as you know, is um, a former CIA analyst who did White House briefings, and um, he is a writer, and you've read his columns. We actually took the name of the this year's conference from one of the uh, articles he wrote, The Moral Imperative of Activism, and when we saw that, we were reviewing his website uh, when we had invited him to speak, and he said, what, what strikes you as an interesting topic? And I said, this would be great for this year's conference because so many of us um, realize the moral imperative of activism that we really need to stand up and make our voices heard in whatever way we can now because we are a society that is in distress. Uh, and that's most unfortunate. But with people like us, we still have a chance at writing the course of our nation and becoming uh, a respectable uh, nation in the community of nations. So uh, Ray's um, moral imperative of activism became the topic for today's uh, conference, and it is actually the topic of Ray's speech. So please welcome Ray McGovern. Thank you. 